Here are my lats right here, okay? You'll see them underneath, often referred to as the wings of the upper body. Shoulders are nice and evenly aligned. I don't have them flexed up to my, you know, my traps flexed up. We want the width, we don't want the height. Whenever we get the height, we lose the aesthetic appeal. You gotta practice, practice, practice with lat spread. It doesn't just come naturally. Uh, one of the techniques that I personally use, a hand over hand uh, front grip, where I focus on squeezing my chest, first off, so I squeeze my chest, you can see the pecs really squeeze, and then what I want is I want to pull apart from my back. I'm not pulling just from my arms, okay, I don't want to pull just from my arms, that doesn't accomplish the purpose here of getting the back and width, okay, so I'm going to grab, clinch hard, squeeze the chest first, okay, so flex the pecs, and then pull apart from my back, you know, you see body movement give you a full lat spread. And while for bodybuilders that looks great because it shows the depth and width of their muscles, for everyone else, we just want the lats to appear during our uh, standard pictures or, or whatever we're doing. Come on, Ashley, come show your lat spreads with Daddy one time. Show Mommy your muscles. <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's uh, the common technique I use to spread my lats. Uh, let me know down below if you've got anything that you use or if you have any questions how to better engage uh, these muscle groups.